watching One Tribe Weekly, where we will bring you the latest news and information from Patuga High School. The Indians ended their football season two weeks ago with a second round playoff loss to Raven County. We want to congratulate our football team on a great season. The basketball season has officially begun and the boys and girls played in Thanksgiving tournaments last week. The girls defeated Bremen and Mount Zion. The boys beat Eastridge. The Indians were scheduled to play Rockmart this Friday at home, but the game has been canceled due to Rockmart still being in the football playoffs. You can catch the girls Saturday, December 1st at 12. They will host North Cobb Christian. We will be back after a short break. Stay tuned to One Tribe Weekly. One Tribe Weekly on Sky 21, brought to you by Georgia Northwestern Technical College with six locations to serve you. Georgia Northwestern Technical College is now accepting applications for classes. We offer programs in business, health, industrial, and public service at six campus locations with financial aid options as well. Take day, evening, or online classes to get your degree, diploma, or certificate. Apply now. Drop by one of our campuses today or check us out at gntc.edu. Georgia Northwestern Technical College. Get focused. Get hired. softball players celebrated their season with a banquet honoring the players and coaches. Seniors Allie Mitchell and Sydney Marshall were presented with game jerseys and medals. Hannah Thrasher and Clara White received the coaches award. Emma White earned the Lady Indian Award and Graceland Beach and Jesse Martin each earned a Golden Glove Award and the team's highest batting average award went to Jesse Martin with an average of points 466. Seven Lady Indians were recently named to the Rome News Tribune's all-region team. Hannah Thrasher, J.C. Martin, and Clara White and Sydney Marshall each made the first team. Grayson Beach and Emma White were named to the second team. Katie Williams was named to the third team. And that wraps it up for this segment of One Tribe Weekly. Join us next week for more of what's happening at Chautauqua High.